Hey Sparkling Stars, it's Friday and it is exciting because it is Friday, July 10th. It's payday. Yay! Super excited. Okay, so I am coming to you today with a booking tip because I think it's super important to share with you what I'm doing and it may work for you, it may not, but there's lots of booking games out there. You can Google them. There's tons of ideas, but this is one that I um, kind of took from a Cincy leader and decided to make it my own and so this is what I've come up with. So basically what I have here is a booking board and I've shown this before but I wanted to share it again. So I have chosen six items that I am comfortable this summer and fall to give away at my parties. These are items that are still in the fall catalog so I'm perfectly okay with what I've got here so I can use this all fall. Now as we get closer to spring of course I'll change it out. But how it's going to work is at my party, if I've done the backwards catalog party um, script, I'm going to give the first person I'm standing beside the dice. So you need one dice. And I'm going to say to them, okay, so we have one final thing I need to do before I let you ladies shop. Um, I'm going to pass around the dice, and I want you all to roll the dice. And whatever number you roll, I want you to write it down at the top of your order form. And this um, coincides with the prize that you are going to receive from me. Um, and we'll talk more about that um, when you come and check out with me. And I'm going to leave it at that. When they come with their order form, I'm going to say, okay, Sally, what did you roll? And she's going to say, I rolled um, a number five. And I'm going to be like, oh my gosh, you rolled a number five? Guess what? So you've won a large utility tote in addition to all the additional hostess rewards that we have just by holding your own party. So what party style works best for you? I didn't mention book a party. Notice I said what party style works best for you. I really think it's all about the way we word things. It's much harder for someone to say, I don't want to hold a, I don't want to book a party. If you ask, do you want to book a party? Um, it's harder for them to say no if you say what party style works best for you. And it will take you guys some practice to do. Um, it's taking me some practice, but I'm much more comfortable saying, so what party style works best for you? Because if you think about it, put yourself in their shoes, I'm going to be like, well, what, what are my options, right? Right, so then I'm gonna say, okay, well, we can do what Kim did today, which is hold her own party in her home. We can do an on-the-go party, which is at a local restaurant. We could do a ballpark. Um, we could do the pool. Or we also have catalog um, online parties. So the option's up to you. Notice, I did not offer Facebook parties because I don't want Facebook parties. That's my personal decision. If Facebook parties work well for you, great. But for my business, I'm done with them. So I give them three options and then we see what happens. You can do the same thing and this is one thing I really love about this idea is do this at my vendor events. Now I'm not going to ask every single person that walks by to roll the dice but if I see someone who is really really interested in our products standing at my table I'm going to say hey so you want to play a little game? Roll the dice. I will have a special prize for you and see what they say. My goal at any vendor event is to book a bunch of parties or gain new team members. It is not about sales. And so I really love this tool for that because I have several things coming up this month and next. I'm also doing my July, um, Christmas in July open house next week. And so I'm having women over to my office. And so I'm going to offer the dice to them as well and see what they say. So wanted to share that tip with you. I hope it works. This document, like I said, is I may have said, I've done this video a couple times, so I may have screwed up, sorry. Um, but anyways, this document is in the file section of our lineage page. So you can find it there, and then you can tweak it and make it your own and put your own little items in there. These items may not work for you, and that's okay. Make it what works with your budget. Talk to you later.